Good morning, right, it's James again from Motorhome Retrofits and another one of our videos that we wanted to showcase is the Vision Plus um, TV antenna. Now, this one has been quite tricky. So this particular model is the Status 570. There's a short mast and a long mast. The problem is with these vehicles, there's not a great deal of room inside to fit it. We've had to be very, very careful in terms of where to fit it. And as you can see, if Tim zooms in on the camera, you've got the raised part of the roof and you've got the recessed. We've gone recessed so that the mounting plate then can be screwed and fitted down with tech screws and we've gone and sycophlexed all the way around so there's no possible chance that water will get in. At the moment the antenna is in the raised but the vertical position and then using the antenna amplifier you can manually turn the antenna around and adjust the gain which is a 15 decibel maximum gain for you to receive your digital free view um, broadcasting or free to air channel. Um, now this is ideal, we do a lot of these on motorhomes and camper vans. Camper vans are a little bit more tricky just purely because of placement. In a motorhome you can pop it in a wardrobe, you've got a nice flat roof to work with and they are much easier to work with. But as you can see uh, this has all been done very nicely and neatly and we've only really had one position on the roof to be able to mount it. So I'm going to jump down and adjust the antenna so that it's horizontal and we'll come back to you in a second. Right, so what I've done is I've just adjusted the TV aerial to the horizontal plane um, and depending on where you are in the country or where you are uh, in Europe, you can have it on a vertical or horizontal plane depending on where uh, and what sort of TV signals you're trying to connect to. The other thing is, is uh, you've also then got your height adjustment so that the actual aerial itself, whether it's on a horizontal or vertical plane, can be adjusted so it can be higher or lower. And then using the signal finder on the amplifier that goes from red, yellow to green, you can see how strong the signal is. And then depending on the signal, you can adjust that boost into the TV to give you a much better, clearer picture. Right, so going back to the original part of the video, we said that this vehicle is particularly tricky. The TV is mounted the other side of the bathroom here, but the only area in the vehicle that you can have this is in the bedroom section. The head of the sleeper is up this end and the feet are down this end, and this does not obstruct you. And we've tried to make it as neat as possible because that's what we're all about. And it's nice and neat so that it's not really sort of intrusive in your way and that's uh, that's the most important thing but it has to be functional so you just undo the collar like so and before you can do anything uh, let's just show you actually we're on green at the moment which is horizontal so you just spin the little wheel around just move the cable out the way spin the wheel and you'll see that the red is changing that then changes it to vertical like so but for you to be in transit mode so you just put it back down to horizontal. So like that, and you undo the collar a tiny bit and you bring the orange round here without twisting the cable. So you bring the orange sticker down like so, and then you can just pull the mast down itself. Now it'll go down as far as it can, this particular vehicle, we have got this rear roof hatch here, so you have to be careful of that. But once you've pulled the aerial down, Tim will just show you exactly what that looks like on the roof. And all I do to secure it is tighten that up. Once you're traveling, you should always have the mast facing away from you uh, so that it's not affected by the wind. Right, okay. So if Tim now comes back down, what we we'll do is we'll just we won't bore you to death by putting the TV on and showing you all the channels, but we will show you what the amplifier setup looks like and the adaptability for it and also how to tune in the signal. Right, so already fitted from factory is the Avtex Pro. It's only a little baby TV, but again, you're limited with space. Uh, and this TV, once you release the mechanism here, uh, just slides out and round. So it's quite, um, it's quite functional in that respect. So here's the TV antenna amplifier system. Here's our 12 volt power that's been neatly um, cable clipped in here. And this is the main aerial coming into it here. 
Um, now from factory you also get a little control board that allows you to plug in um, whether you're using a satellite dish or whether you're using a conventional coax TV antenna. You flick the switch on at the top once you've put the aerial up and adjusted it, you can then adjust the gain. And what you can do with that is once you're on site, um, you adjust the gain, it goes from red through to yellow to green, and then you know you've locked onto a good signal. But you've also got outputs for digital radio and then other multiple TVs if you want. So if you've got one in the bedroom, if you're in a coach built motorhome, chances are that you would anyway, or even possibly have one outside. So it's simple enough to do. You turn your TV on, you do an auto scan, it finds the channels. If sometimes the picture's a bit blocky or the sound disappears, uh, then you can just adjust the gain. It's a 15 dB gain on here, and you can just adjust that because sometimes you can actually over adjust uh, in certain areas where you're on flat ground. So this is the Vision Plus status, it's the 570 comes with the built-in amplifier and you can connect it up once it's in and fitted it means that you have complete control over your tv reception and um, we think it's fantastic it's the only tv aerial that we fit to be honest and there are quite a few on the market so this is motorhome retrofits thanks for watching website is www.motorhomeretrofits.co.uk don't forget to subscribe and if you have any questions about your vehicle or any product that we sell or do videos on don't forget to get in touch thanks for watching